Hi, I'm Jeremy and I'm your host of Tell Me Wine TV and today is a tasting show and today we're trying a uh, wine from the Wicks Estate in the Adelaide Hills, uh, Cabernet Sauvignon, 100% Cabernet Sauvignon uh, from the land of Shiraz. It's 15% alcohol and uh, it's 2005 vintage so I'm expecting a little bit of uh, uh, nuancedness and a little bit more reservation, a little bit more quietness. As the um, as the aromas start to open up and the alcohol starts to die down, it's 15% alcohol and it's 31.25, and it's a screw cap. Very dark, very dark, dark plum, black plum, much darker than some of the Shiraz that we've been looking at earlier in other shows but really, really, really opaque. Can't not see through it. Not showing age. None of that orange tinge, copper around the edge. This is a nice wine so far. The alcohol is very contained on the nose. It's not, I'm not losing my nose hair, um, you know, as, this, as the alcohol pushes up to it. It's 15%, which is still a lot, but again, that could be as low as 13.5%. So let's hope it's there. Much quieter nose than some of the Shiraz. Uh, no eucalyptus, uh, uh, though a touch extracted. So it's hot fruit. And I'm getting it like black plum, like in a tart, baked. Some leathery notes. Maybe a little anise. Very soft tannins, very soft tannins. It's cherry, it's chocolate, it's a little bit of uh, cinnamon. Um, very, very elegant wine for Australia. Now Australia can make some big brooding monsters. This is, this is, this is atypical and really quite good. I like it. The Wicks Estate. Great with all of the usual suspects, steak, stew, um, you know, chops, anything roasted with some fat on it, you know, um, a, uh, what do you call it, a, um, a rib chop or something like that. Delicious wine, Wicks Estate, 3125. Cheers.